How's it going out there? Welcome from H2 Tech Video. Today I want to show you how to listen to the radio on your Kindle Fire HD. You're going to download an app that's called TuneIn, TuneIn Radio. We're going to go ahead and tap on it. This is a fully free app. There is a paid version that, that doesn't have advertisements and also it lets you like download some of your favorite shows uh, that you listen to. Maybe if you're going to miss it or something. So um, I don't have that one. I just have the free one because, you know, it, the free one does everything I need. So let me kind of show you how it works. Um, you can go to local radio and it'll use your uh, your Wi-Fi code to kind of determine what's in the area. So uh, usually you'll find the shows that you like or the stations you like from here, um, but not always. But I see a couple of ones I like, like for example, 93.5 is a station I listen to a lot. Shout out to DJ Dense, awesome DJ on the radio. See how fast it pops up, lets you stream what's currently being played. We can stop it here and go back. The, pro the one thing though, when you stop it, it doesn't pause it. Okay, it's streaming, so it's playing live. I think it's like a 45 to a minute delay. So you can't pause it, come back an hour, and expect to be able to hear the show. If you have the the uh, the paid version, I believe it does let you download it, and you can do that. Uh, so I want to make this a favorite so I can come back to it easier. So I just tap on this little heart in the corner right here. And now I've added K-Day as a uh, favorite. So now I'm going to go back, and let's keep going down the list. Let's see, 94.7 The Wave, also a great station. Let's see what's playing right now. Okay, a little jazz going on there. I'm going to uh, favorite that as well. Let's go back. Let's go. That is an awesome remix. That's a remix of John B. Uh, they don't know. That is awesome. All right, let me uh, get back to the uh, the video here. Power 106, another favorite here. Gonna go ahead and favorite that. I will stop that. Go back. So now watch this. If I go to favorites right here, there are my uh, stations there and them them saved. So it just makes it easier for me to go back to them later on when I open the app. Now watch this. I can have this playing. Sometimes it takes a second to buffer, so just kind of watch right there. I can have this playing. I can go home. I can open a different app. I can um, open a book and be reading, have a little background music. Okay. I can then, I can use the volume here to control it. So if I want to turn it down a little bit, you can have some nice mood music for when you're reading. Uh, you can also go to the internet. You could be browsing the web. Okay. Let's see. Let's go on the website here. And notice it has not glitched. Now, obviously, the, the clarity and how good it streams will depend on how good your internet connection is. So, um, just know that that if it's the audio is a little bit glitchy, it's not the app. It's more so your internet connection. Okay. So, go on one of my favorite um, YouTube channels, Ask the Android Guy. And again, you could be on the web browsing and it's just going to play in the background. So, pretty cool. Don't need any extra antennas or anything. Um, you can just literally enjoy the radio while you're doing what you do on the Kindle. You can even go home. We can go to our email. Hey, I need to check my email. See if anyone sent me anything important. Um, I could be doing all this. Open up this. Da da da. So, and if you want to get back to the app, we can just pull down here and we will, actually you can't do it from there. You would have to find it back here and you'll be back into the app. Okay. So really awesome app, TuneIn Radio. I love this app because I've been trying to find a way to listen to the radio from my phone for years. and. Uh, I don't know why it took so long for them to get this up and running here. Sorry, my screen's a little dirty. Only the black screen really lets you see it, how dirty it is. So sorry about that. But um, I, I use this app all the time. I use it on my smartphone when I'm at school, just walking around. Um, you do have to have an internet connection, so just keep that in mind. You will have to be somewhere where there's internet. 
Um, but you could be at home. You could plug this up to a speaker, play the radio right from your Kindle. Don't have to worry about having a special antenna or having batteries for your little old school radio. You can do it all now from your Kindle Fire HD. So definitely recommend you download this app. It is free. Free is the keyword. So um, download it, enjoy it. Uh, let me also show you this. If you don't see your favorite radio station come up in that list, you can type in the numbers. I'm gonna type in 102.3. Um, and there it is okay tap on that and then so just another way to find your station for whatever reason if you don't see it when you um, go through the, the local uh, listing I want to favorite that as well okay now here's another thing, cool thing some stations you listen to the song um, the app will recognize the song you can actually tap the little Amazon the a here it says a mp3 and you can actually go and you can buy that mp3 right from the Amazon store okay but well, just another cool thing how they've added the integration so if you wanted that song here it is and you can buy it for 99 cents okay so this is a really cool built-in feature they've added listen to the radio you like that song well download it right then and there you know Let's go back. I wish I had downloaded that song that was on the wave because I really like that song actually. But um let me see if it's still playing actually. Let's go back. Let's go back again. Favorite. And then I bet it's over now. Probably missed it. But anyway, guys, this is it. Um really really awesome app um, keep in mind that not every single station is on here I have found a couple that at certain times of the day you can't listen to their station so uh, just be aware of that most of the main ones are locked in so you don't have to worry about it but every now and then there might be a station that doesn't let you stream their radio so just keep that in mind hope you found this helpful go ahead and like the video give it a thumbs up um, subscribe to X2 Tech videos and keep watching give me your feedback I hope that again you like this and that uh, you'll download this and enjoy the app alright thanks for watching again and have a good one